shit. Okay, possibly the sickest nigga coming out my region Got that new God flow, bless the niggas, they ain't sneezing I'm the reason why your wife be creeping Texting why you sleeping, yeah we eating Why y'all speak on beefing, all y'all niggas be I know how y'all came up with the name America's Addiction And basically what's the meaning behind it Alright, well, we gonna introduce ourselves first Yeah, I'm David Kelly uh, from America's Addiction What do you do? Let me talk, nigga. <laughs> the vocalist, light skin niggas gotta be extra. The vocalist, the rapper, you know what I mean? Like, that's what I do. I try to sing, but. He can't fuck with it. I can't fuck with it, whatever. He ain't able. So, who, who's the best, like, uh, music artist between y'all two? Well, he does production, though, you know what I mean? He does, like, he handles behind the scenes, shit. I'm right. more. So, the, it's more like a teamwork. So, it's more like a bigger brand, more than music at the end of the day. Yeah. Yeah. It's a. It's very intricate. It's like a spider web that we probably ain't got enough time to go into at this point. But in a nutshell, in a nutshell, what we do is we make music, but we also motivate people outside of our music. You know what I mean? Like, behind all that, well, the meaning behind that, you know, America has addiction, violence, sex, drugs, greed, envy, all that type of shit you see on TV, all that stuff that's in the movies, all that stuff that's in our music, all that stuff that's in the streets, no matter what city that you're in. Sex, you know, violence, whatever. So, and also, going back to crack music with uh, Kanye West and Game, there was a line in there at the end, somebody was spitting some poetry, some of this dark diction has become America's addiction. Sure. When I look at dark diction, I take that's like, okay, that's like ethnic, black, Latino art, words, stuff like that, and that became America's addiction. So when did y'all like actually get into like the music industry and start taking it more seriously? Uh, well, uh, let's see. I started around 2006. That's 2006, 2005. 2005. Yeah, I've been doing that shit for a while. So, um, my my dad actually had got me into it. Like, he wanted me to just focus on something besides like negative shit in the street. So, he bought like uh, him and him and my dad because this is like my uncle by marriage. Well. Used to be, but um, yeah, it's an interesting story. It's an interesting story. <laughs> yeah, but my dad and him, they basically bought some stuff, you know, like studio equipment and stuff like that. We created a MySpace account. He handled all like the the promotion and the marketing and stuff like that. I just knocked out hella songs. We came up with a group called like the Black House Gang. Mm -hmm. It was like six of us or like seven. It was a lot of us, but you know, we just made music and then I ended up getting in Vibe magazine around like two thousand. Alright, so would you say your uh, following right now is different from your typical fan base that any other artist would see? And how would you explain your following right now? Alright, yeah, it's crazy. Our our own fan base, it doesn't consist of, like, my cousin or my mom. My mom was my biggest fan of Shots of Mom. But, nah. like, family members or friends I grew up with or, you know, people from high school. It's actually people scattered all over the world, like people in Germany. Um, New Jersey, LA, Chicago, like people I've never met before. These people gravitate towards us because they feel like we don't belittle them. You know, a lot of artists treat their fans like, like nothing. We treat our fans more like a family, like the addicts is what we call them. So, you know, we're all together in one. And, and that's the other. It's your boy David Kelly from America's Addiction. You even say it right. I'm Jay the Truth, Josh from America's Addiction. And we're here at USD to our mag. Potent Vision. And what was that again? Jungle music. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying. I I've been doing this a minute. They didn't let me off the leash. We got caught on the beat. Now they all in.